I'm sorry. <laughs> Nice work, Sam. Thanks for covering me. I killed it! You don't have to... She, she knows what she's doing. What? I don't mind passengers. What are you talking about? Next time. What are you talking about, Sam? I was gonna like see like what ammo he had, see if he actually used the bullets in his inventory. I remember to equip an actual weapon before I. Yeah, this gun does no damage to an Ashta. It also does like four damage a shot. I like need to find a better laser weapon. I need to find a lot better weapons that aren't just this. It does so much damage. It has like such cheap ammo. Where is the mineralogical guy? Who gave me this quest in the first place? Uh, rescued the. Mineralogical Inc. Miner has been safely returned to their crew. Talk to Sam Co. Huh? Sam, you know anything about this? No problem. It's. Well, it's raining now, Sam! Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Like, you can, like, see the rain coming down. But, like, if you stand right here, you can, like... It looks like the rain is actually being blocked. I think. Oh, no, because it's an actual building. That's probably why. You can, like, actually hear the, uh... Rain, like, on the outside of the building, I think. It'd be cool if that was just a meteor and we all just died. Uh, I think I think we've done all that we can here. I'm gonna fast travel back. We have some stuff to sell, but I'll just dump them in the ship and we can sell them later. I don't want to bog down this recording any further. Also, wait, no, we need to check in with Keone. I just remembered that with no help whatsoever. Trust me. Welcome to Aquila City. I get it. It's not that bad of a city. I like it. You do not want to go outside the city walls. You see those ads Ashta for will rip you apart. You thinking about oh, it trust out? me, I'd never dream of going it? out there. What is the quest? I think the quest, like, kind of bugged out. But, you know, whatever. It's been a while since we had the chance to catch up. Hold on, this is a new building that I haven't been into before. Midtown Minerals. There's not enough to do around here. Is there not? Ask anyone. Midtown Minerals is a glass joint. I can tell. Might want to steer clear of the stretch. Uh, of Lots course, of I don't mind passengers. There. I think my game glitched out somehow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna save the game and I'm gonna <laughs> reload because everybody. Is saying things. Is that the is that the moon? Hold on. Did you know that ship's reactor is a single source of power for an entire ship? So I should let you know. Hey. You meet all sorts in Aquila City. I think the game. So long. Is, the game is glitched out and everybody's just <laughs> Everybody wants to, like, talk to me about getting on my ship, I think. I need to, like, I might need to, like, reload a save. You. Well, I'm gonna have to reload a save. Good thing I hit that quick save. This is that quick save, right? I, like, looked up in the sky while the uh, miner was, like, following us. Uh-oh. <laughs> Reminder, it's a Bethesda game. Quick save often. Oh, now I need to find up with another topic of conversation. Well, let me just talk to you before you, like... My hero. Really? 
I can't believe I'm alive. I can. So, uh, it probably won't come as a surprise, but we could use a lift. Ah, eh, no problem. Thank you. We're so lucky you happened by. Transport the mineral... Mineralogical ink miners to a safe settlement. Ah, I see. There's like a... Oh my god, that's it. It feels... That's just a cool image. I was about to say, it's, it's like an image right out of uh, Outer Wilds. But then I was like, that's... Of course, it's space. <laughs> of course it would feel like that. Let me just let me just double check to see what my actual quest says. Transport the mineralogical ink miners to a safe settlement. Do I actually have to walk you there? Because if so, oh boy. There's ash there's ash all around this place. Where'd you go? There's, there's Sam. Where the Where's the person I rescued? Hello? I'm like trying to see if I can see like a human shaped figure running around. Not you. I'm just gonna walk over to this place. Oh, how, how far is the walk though? Oh, that's. It's like 2,000 meters this way. I'm just... I'm just gonna sprint there. I don't even care that I'm running out of oxygen. I wonder what's the most... Uh... Calm down, enemies over in that direction. Ashto. Oh, yeah, it definitely seems like the most efficient way of running is to, uh, like, run until you're, uh, like, almost out of oxygen. You start running, you keep running until the red is happening, and then go there, because it takes so long to get your oxygen back once you, like, fill the meter with red. Although, that, with that being said, being able to, like, boosting while running is, seems pretty efficient. Because you, like, regain oxygen while boosting. You don't want this smoke. You don't want this smoke, Ashta. It's not that far away, guys, right? Look. I'm just assuming as soon as I get back, the quest is going to complete. Either that or I'm just going to give up the quest right there. I, uh, yeah. As far as I'm concerned, I've done, I've, done my, I've done my time for this quest. There we go. I wonder if I could... It says, like, like transport or whatever. I wonder if, like, it would count if I actually fast-traveled. I'm gonna quick save and I'm like, just gonna fast-travel there to see if, like, that counts as completing this quest. That's a neat image. I like that. Yes? What? Aha, of course! Welcome, I totally guided you all this way. Mm-hmm. My money! Come on. Wait, no. Can we talk to them? Thanks again. <clears throat> I can't thank you enough. Hey. Hey, wait. Where is you? Where's... Where's this quest pointing me towards? Transport the miners to a safe settlement. Ask me to take them to Wagoner Farm and I've agreed to help. 
Alright, well, I'll take them there once I've settled other quests in this place. Sorry. What about that zoo? That's over that direction. That place is barely a zoo. Alright, so... I guess I accidentally... Ex I accidentally accepted a quest to... Uh, have some work for someone like you. To, to send these people somewhere. <sighs> it's fine, it's fine. I probably would have accepted anyway. But... We need to wait for this quest to, uh, trigger. Saw your ship come in. Nice ride. It is. Uh, now that we've fixed our game... There's not enough to do around here. We can talk oh, with you. You an independent hauler? I can promise you the best rate in town. So I... I was just really distracted by what that guy said. Also, I'm here to pick up then some minerals, I guess? Then you've come to the right place. Huh. I could just buy some. I could just buy some minerals. Give me one nickel. Thank you for your service. Service? Thank you for your... Thanks oh, again. Of this. Hello. Oh, you followed me in here? That's... You didn't have to do that. Well, we're kind of just waiting around yes. in here. Until the 24 hours pass. So what we're going to do is we're going to head into my ship... We're gonna sleep for like a little bit. Actuary. Actually? We're gonna go into our ship. We're gonna sleep for like a couple hours. Nobody's allowed outside the city walls after nightfall. Try and stop me. And then we're going to uh complete this quest for Kuoni or whoever whatever their name was. Yo ship's not off. I wouldn't go that far. It's pretty bad. Hello, Captain. Like, bad in, like, a cool way. All right, the full three. Forge green. Ready for what comes next. What's been happening here? Thank you for having me aboard. I hope oh. we arrive without any trouble. Just a big-ass steak. Hi! No, you're not the person. Where's... Where's... Where's Rosa? We invited her to our ship. Hey, Dad. There you are. Need something, Captain? Might have answered some personal questions. Of course. What's on your mind? Uh, what are you interested in? You got it. What do you want to know? I don't know. I made you want to become a doctor. It runs in the family. My mum's a doctor, too. She practiced at the clinic when she was younger, and now she works at the core in the Kila City. I want to follow her footsteps and practice at the clinic someday, too. But I'm not comfortable enough with space travel yet to live on a star station full time. That's why my mum encouraged me to find a job like this. She said working as a ship's doctor would be great practice. Mm, I'm not familiar with the clinic. What else? Tell me more. The clinic's the most advanced medical facility in the galaxy. The doctors there pride themselves on being able to cure any disease, even ones they just discovered. They have an entire hmm. research have team dedicated to the ligma? study of newly emerging xenoviruses. xenoviruses That's really why word. I want to work there someday. Helping to create botanical treatments for newly discovered diseases would be a dream come true. Oh, I'm sorry, I just had to turn on my fan real quick. It is getting way too hot in my room. Also, botany then. My papa taught me everything I know. He learned about it from my koro, and my koro learned from his mother. Yeah, Plants I know that Plants are really means. important on that side of my family. Generations ago, my ancestors on Earth used medicinal plants to heal the sick. When humanity took to the stars, we brought the tradition with us. I see, I'm the I latest in a long hmm. line of Tannehills to practice botanical medicine. Have your family's processes changed any at all? No. We still practice the same traditions we always have, but we have a lot more plants to work with now. Mm, the like Cheyenne system's chock too. full of useful flora. My family's been incorporating them in our medicinal practices since we settled on Aquila. It's important that you, you, you do with I that. I agree. It's important to stay connected with the things we left behind on Earth. Our traditions Earth. are a big part of what makes us human. 
Uh, let Go me for do it. something else. I don't know. Let me know if you change now. your mind. I don't want to exhaust the whole dialogue right now. Right now, I want to take a nap for ten hours. Make it six. Let's get back to it. I awake and feeling well rested. This is quite a vessel. You must do well for yourself. Yeah, pretty well. Where's Sarah? There you are. All right, well. I can't thank you enough. You can and you will. I owe you a beer. You don't have to keep following me. You can just wait in the ship. Ah, oh, whatever. On to, on to whatever this person's name was. Forget exactly what this quest is about. Leader of the pack. All oh, right, the Ashta sensors. Right, we're redoing that because the first time was interfered with. Got a freighter coming soon. No time to talk. Uh huh. I'm sure. This place is pretty, where it's very overcast and raining. I like it. to be smarter, smarter better in the way we handle the ashta hey hey how have you been staying out of trouble no no you know i can ask the same of you i suppose you could things here have been well they're better the isis thought a bit between me and davis we'll probably never be friends but at least we're on speaking terms now I think he finally appreciates the value of my research. Hell yeah. So, I'm glad you're getting along, I guess. Yeah, we're much better as a team, even if it is a cautiously engaged one. In fact, speaking of Davis, I have to confess, I'm a little worried about him. Hey, what about the In data you've been researching? In analyzing the recent data, I've isolated readings suggesting that someone is making patrols far more often than in the recent past. I don't have any direct evidence, but I know it's Davis. It's gotta be. It's the only person I'm I know I'm worried of. that everything I've inadvertently put him through is kind of, I don't know, pushed him over the edge, or at least a little too close to it. You know, if you're really worried you gotta talk about it. I have recognized that Davis has an emotional reaction to my I've presence. I've also sensed that. We're on speaking terms, empath. but he still gets agitated. I don't want to make things worse. You want I'm me to better with to statistics him. and circuits than I am with people. I've already made a mess of this situation. Do you think you could go speak to him? Yeah. If nothing else, it would ease my conscience. Yeah. All right, Davis. Oh, that's all I'm ready. All right, Davis. <laughs> oh. I fall further than I. I, I can't believe fall faster Bailey did such a bonehead than move. I thought it would. Yo, oh, brother, why is it every time I see your face, I bet a headache's gonna follow shortly after? Sorry. <laughs> you know, like, you, you might you might want to see a doctor about that. Maybe I will. Let's see where this goes. Uh oh. So what can I do for you? So. Me and all of everybody that you love is here to talk about how we are so worried with how much time you've been you, you're spending outside the walls. I don't know whether I should be reassured that someone cares or creeped out that someone's watching me that closely. It wasn't me. Ah, that woman, I swear. Even though we've smoothed over most of the rough spots, she still manages to strike a nerve without even trying. I mean... If you, if you need help, you can just ask. Maybe I do. Maybe I don't. Not sure yet. Well, when we were out there and we found that robot, obviously that threw me for a loop. 
Still can't believe one of my own people will pull a stunt like that, endangering us all. But the more I thought about it, that whole episode doesn't account for some of the tracks I yeah, saw. Yeah, gosh, there. Too large, too spread out. You are thinking there's some other creature out there. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of. All right, if there's a it? bigger Ashta out there, something meaner than what we've seen so far, I have to know. I tell you what, if you and Kiona are worried, why don't you just come with me then? All right. Either I get an extra gun in a fight, or you get to laugh at the old man and say, I told you so. I hope you don't mind if I'll three, like, miners come with us. Miners with an E. And, uh, maybe grab the biggest gun you got, just in case. Uh, the biggest gun I got is not the best gun I got. Let's go. All right. You know, Kioni showed me her data. She's a clever kid. She's got a lot of things figured out. I think we can make some real improvements in the future. She Sam, had a couple can't... sets of data that Sam, she thought were up. erroneous or something. But it seems say words to me that it of. might not be. A bigger, faster Ashta sounds like it matches up with the tracks I've seen. But I tell you, I'm hoping mm. she's right and it's just a glitch. And uh, no need to tell her I said that. Wouldn't want it going to her head. All right, here we are. Let's head this way. Go to direction as any, pal. I'm following you. It's kind of interesting being somebody else's companion. I else remember a story from the first time I was here on the Kila. I had totally forgotten about it till recently. Every so often, we get independent types who think that they can succeed where everyone else is. Let's, let's no, hold on. Oh, you just press R to fast travel. I'm trying to point out to the the fact that that's a very large blue sun. Fail. Some of them stride off into the wilderness, Weird. certain that they're going to make more credits than anyone in history. Mining, botany stuff, whatever. Warners just don't get through to them. Most of them don't come back. But this one time miner from right. some corporation or other, he drags himself back into the city He's bloody family. and half dead. Claimed he seen a ash the big as a house out there. The older uh -huh. guys all said he was delirious. And me, well, I was new as anything and just listened to him. Now, though, I'm wondering if Welcome maybe back. it wasn't just blood loss and he stroke. Maybe he really did see something. Well, maybe I should have come out here a long he time ago. Hits, uh... Shit, that's gotta be it. I'm sure that's not him. No matter what happens, you make it back to the city and tell him about this. You hear me? Quick save. Optional. Make sure Davis. That's one big son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. I just I think I just fell down a hill. Hey! Come come keep hitting me. Oh my god, this god is this gun is too powerful. Run! Are you good? Nice. I'm Shot. Good. Hell, I'm great. God, this gun is too good. If we didn't have proof, nobody would believe us about the Alpha. I'm not gonna lie to you. I didn't think we were gonna make it through that. I you hadn't been gun. with me, no way I'd be standing right now. Never thought there'd be a day when I saved the Davis Wilson. You did it, land the final hit. That was fun. I wanna, I wanna do that again. <laughs> You are something else, you know that? I thought enemies we got out alive that this one that time. Like 20? That's good. But this ain't gonna be the last time we have to deal with this. Maybe like now that we know these like things are on the walls, we need to track them and keep them out of populated areas. And that plan is gonna need everybody. Man, if only you had some sort of researcher. So I'm gonna swallow like, my pride a bit here. Yeah, there you go. And ask you to go tell Keone what we ask found. Me to do it. Let her know that her data wasn't an error and that she needs to focus on it. <sighs> I mean, I, I don't want to leave you out here. Oh, don't worry about me. I will. Thanks again for saving my ass. You know, I'm the one that that Ashta hit, and it, like, barely did any damage to me. I, I, think, I think Davis was fine. I think that thing was just masquerading as having, like, 20, 20 levels. I don't think it was that strong. Better we get it than someone else. 
Yeah, you know, God forbid somebody gets that alien genetic material. Creates an army of Ashta. Dear God. Actually, that is a pretty... Might be actually a common occurrence. Common-ish. All right. What what a what a long quest line for like just a conversation I heard in an alleyway. Sam, where? Are... People joke, say those Varun zealots worship a snake. But let me tell you, it ain't a snake. It's some kind of celestial being. They call it the Great Serpent. Is it real? <laughs> Hell if I know. Well, wow, it's really cool, guy. They think Sam, we gotta get out of here. <laughs> You're out there a lot, right? In space. I could just started talking about, to me about the space snake, and I, I, I don't want to listen to that. <laughs> it's, it's terrifying. <laughs> uh, I just passed Keone. I wasn't watching the uh, quest line, quest marker. That's what it's called. Mm hmm. Keone! Is this your friend? So, what happened? Yeah. Uh, we, uh, yeah, you know, I killed it. Also, uh, Davis said your, your help was critical in keeping Aquila City safe from a new Ashta threat, and also no, he's fine. He didn't. There's no way Davis would say that, even if it's true. Yeah, I kinda lied. But it is true, isn't it? My data was accurate. You know. I was really hitting a point where I was starting to think maybe this was all a mistake. That I stuck my nose into something I shouldn't have. Davis was so certain they had everything under control that they didn't want or need my help. But they did, didn't they? they did. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you know your worth. Don't let anybody tell you yeah, what it was. Yeah, you're right. If anything, this has proven I should trust my instincts. Yeah, just don't. I need don't to get, get to work on this head, yeah. immediately. But while I've been sitting around, I whipped up a little oh, something yeah? for you. I thought it was funny. Uh, now that I'm giving it to you, I'm hoping it's not in really poor taste. What anyway, is it? Anyway, thank you again. No problem. A legendary weapon. The despondent assassin. Whoa, we. Ooh. Let's see. Demoralizing. Small chance to demoralize a target. You, you were working on this. Weird. Uh, does more damage when aiming? Huge. Does more damage against humans? Small magazine and high powered. Whoa. 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 That's like a really good weapon. Like, I'm thinking of replacing this, my, uh, my assassin's Grendel that I have right now with that. It's gonna, it's gonna, it, it, it does a little bit more damage. I don't know how fast it fires, but it has a bigger scope. And also it's a legendary weapon. It also looks cooler. I'll try it out once I... Now let me think, let me check the quest log. Is there anything else that I need to do here? Beer run, don't care, rough landings. Can't do that here. Deputized, free star collective, become a I'm a ranger. No, don't want to do that quite yet. Top of the list. Can't do that here. I think we're, I think we're all done in Aquila. I can't think of nothing else that we can do here. Well, actually, hold on. Let's go into Roland Arms and see if they sell another weapon. Another, uh, see any other weapons. I, I don't do payment plans. I don't. Do I'm sure I got what you need. Anything new? Nope. 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 No. Pretty gun, but no. Nada. No. Beam part beam pistol, no. Another beam pistol, still no. Beam pistol, no. That's we just got one of those. No. No. Ooh, that thing has a nice scope on it. No. 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 Ooh, oh, that thing looks cool. 
No. Yeah, you really have nothing we want. Well, we got a we got a we got a pretty cool sniper out of that whole ordeal. Maybe the reason I want to use the sniper instead of this gun is because of sunk cost fallacy. I did all that work for this quest just to get this sniper rifle. Let's let's at least pull it out now that we're not in the city. Sure, I'll equip it. I'll uh, favorite it. But I will still keep the Assassin's Grendel on me just in case. We're, what we're really losing out here on this is a uh, like max ammo and probably firing. Good speed, speed, Captain. But you know, we'll never know if we don't try. The core has already finished the pre-flight checklist. Thanks again. That's my girl. Now then, is there anything I want to do on here, bef on in the ship before we get out of here? There's something I can help you with. No, you just keep being you, Matt. I will have some chunks. And I think, I think we go. We drop these miners off wherever they need to be. Pardon. You're pardoned. Out of my way. Actually, hold on. Let's see. Where do we need to go? Zoom out. Ah, it's over here in a... It's in the same system. Before we... Is there any, like, any other, like... Because we could just theoretically head to any other planet here and just, like, explore for a bit. Let's, let's, let's explore... Let's explore these... Let's explore these people's, uh... Places, home, rather. Where they want us to take them. This is also going to be the first time this thing enters orbit. Or not even orbit, just space. As this new uh, updated design. And take off. Struts retracting. Let's get out of here. Oh, uh, this thing is does not look like it was designed for any type of travel. I do love a good, like, Hell of a view from here. piece of hunk of junk. Piece of hunk of junk that flies. Alright. Although I really did wish. One change I would make to this thing. Make, the, make this glass up here as well. I could, like, see such a narrow field. The music's pretty sure is pretty loud. Alright. Uh, put some points into there. Yep, all that's fine. Shoo, let's. Where's our quest? Well, there's a star yard up there. No, wait, we're not looking for a star yard. We're looking for. That's a Kila. It's a bunch of cities. There's an empty nest over that way. Can we? Oh, that's a lot. All right, Matara, that's where we're heading. Not gonna lie, that in ch that in chatter sure is unintelligent. Matara, I think that's where we're heading. Just have a slow cruise that direction. It's in the same galaxy after all. Same star system. Matara in the Cheyenne system. Slow your roll. Is there debris over here? Hold on. Hey, contact Charlie 3. That's you. Charlie 3. Nice to meet you. Bye, Charlie 3. Hi. Hi. I'm Charlie 3. Hi. Just doing my daily pain and forward. Avoid the Altair system. Not big time. For what reason? 
Uh, also, why are you calling me Charlie Kirk? I meet so many people, and I'm just giving up trying to keep track of them all. Fair enough, so honestly. So you're the third Charlie I've met today. Nice to meet you. Okay, fair enough. Thanks for warning me about sure. Altair. I'll make so, sure he doesn't jump on me. I'm doing my rounds, uh, pick up supply drops, and I grab into the Altair system, and oh, <laughs> boy! Spacers all over the damn place there. Distress call, yammering nonstop. That's... Something big's going down there, and all of us with no skin in the game, best we just give it a wide berth. Is that <laughs> Am I right? right? What did the distress calls say? Oh, it sounded bad. I don't know if this is a trap. But I had my own problems. I had to plot a course out before the spacers took out my grav drive. Sorry, I'm just not constitutionally capable of the big space fight thing. Fair enough. Well, man, I might be able to Charlie do that. Three, you are looking to pay it forward like big time. I'm something of an empath. <laughs> I mean, I won't tell you you're crazy, but... <laughs> wow. Bye, Charlie 3. You've been like the best Charlie 3 I've talked to all week. I try. Well, ground pounder in... Oh, God. Why does it look like we were, like, entering a... free fall there? Now, where did you guys actually want to go? Because I don't think you actually wanted to go to, uh... Montada. Wow, it's... Nothing. Oh, we surveyed it. It's a gas giant. It has gravity. It's very cold. It has an atmosphere of H2. Its magnetosphere is extreme. It has no... No, it is nothing. There's nothing. It's nothing. Why do I feel like you guys didn't actually want to come here? Oh, we leveled up. We, we leveled up from scanning this planet. To... Wagoner Farm. Why did I think that? Why did I think that this was that place? Hold on. Let's let's just do this the smart way and like. Well, I was kind of right. Wagoner Farm. Is that course? Yes. Travel. Welcome to Freestar Space. We're gonna do a quick scan for contraband, and you can be on your way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go right ahead. I like how it tells us we have no scan contraband. Scan complete. Just You're in clear case to land. I forget. Now then, where is Montada? Or why do I keep thinking of Montara? Because this is a planet of Montada. Wagoner Farm. That's where we're going. Land there, please. I like. I like having to like not go have to, having to go into a menu to like go Beginning places. Landing cycle. Oh god, don't land on that. Okay. It's... Oh, there is like a little landing place right here for us. What a nice little place this is. It has nice greeneries. All right. Mission updated beer run. Oh, is that Is that where this quest is located? Oh, 60 bucks, a lot of ammo. Remind me to save more people, Sam. I'm something of an empath. And some pie, two med packs as well? Oh. And a demos pack? Okay, I don't really need that one. Amp, honestly, we really don't need that. But I got a hell of a lot for that, though. Looks like we have a, we have a little place that we're gonna explore for the next this episode. Actually, hold on. Zoom back in, please. Rock, uh, fauna, water it. Water. The water is made of chemicals. That's fairly average. I'd say. We got a level. So let's use that level on something. Increases your maximum health. Didn't I say I was going to put it into oxygen just so I can sprint more? Because that'd be really nice. Although, now that I said that, I do want to, like, start getting up to, over to here so I can start upgrading my gear and whatnots. 
Like, I could, have, I could unlock spacesuit design and start actually crafting some cool things. Or even weapon engineering. Oh, I think, I think I have to go for weapon engineering. Unlocking fitness is like, that's just quality of life. Weapon engineering, though, is actually like, Damn near vital, I'd almost say. Or I could get even... Or I could get into botany. Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna... You can craft improved weapon mods at weapon at the weapon workbench. And research additional weapon mods at a research lab. We'll unlock that. We'll look at... Yeah.